to avoid a show of defiance. Residents in the city of Srinagar say law enforcement tightened security, blocking off key roads ahead of Friday prayers after separatists called for a march to a local UN office to protest the revocation of Kashmir's special autonomy. They've closed the streets so that people don't get to pray, don't gather here in large numbers, and so protests can't happen. Kashmir remains in a state of lockdown 19 days after its communications networks were snapped. While some landlines have been restored, thousands remain in detention, including Kashmiri politicians. Standing alongside the Indian Prime Minister during a bilateral visit to France, President Emmanuel Macron refrained from questioning New Delhi's motives, but said he wanted to see tensions with neighbouring Pakistan toned down. In the coming days, I will have an exchange with the Pakistani Prime Minister to remind him of France's will to see this issue treated bilaterally. Kashmir will make its way into the G7 over the weekend when Donald Trump sits down with Narendra Modi. You know, I think we're helping the situation, but there's tremendous uh, problems between those two countries, as you know, and I will do the best I can to mediate or do something. Officials in New Delhi and Islamabad will look out for how Narendra Modi reacts to Donald Trump's offer to mediate after Pakistan shut the door to dialogue.